Hello everybody, this is Money Mom. Welcome back to the channel, Free and Frugal Friday. Let's get started. You guys know I did my Winco haul earlier. Didn't want to incorporate that with the Free and Frugal Friday because I know a few of my videos I go over the five minutes, but I'm really working hard on keeping it five minutes or less. I don't want to get in the habit of going up to the seven to ten minute range. That's for me. So I'm, if I do a grocery haul, I won't be doing it with Free and Frugal Friday. Also, I will not be doing grocery hauls every week. I mentioned that, but somebody had told me that if people do grocery hauls each week and they buy similar items, it does get monotonous. I will only do a grocery haul if I go to a store I don't normally go to, so I can compare to Aldi's, which is my primary store. I primarily go to Aldi's, and I'll go to Kroger's twice a month and then I usually get my free item and a couple other things but that is my those are my primary places that I go to so let me talk about free and frugal Friday good news is Monday through Thursday I didn't spend any money I got a catalog in the mail today from women within I'll be honest with you even though I don't need it I was tempted to buy some Valentine inspired clothing but to be honest with you I already had gotten a couple things from women within a sweat outfit and another shirt type jacket type thing and I did not feel like I needed anything else so I just put the or threw the catalog away thought I'd share that so the good news is I was under grocery budget this week until my friend picked me up something from Costco I'm still under budget a dear friend of mine Teresa and her husband Charlie they got me um, and this was 14 or 13.99 I love Adele sausage it's a three pack they have a membership to Costco I do not they ask me they go I think once a month I think they go and I do not um, go to Costco so every now and then they'll pick me up something and so this was uh, 13.99 which was not bad for Adele sausage it's chicken sausage. The flavor is pineapple and bacon. It's really good. We haven't had it in a long time. I used to do product demos for them. I absolutely love this. Still under budget. Last week I had a, uh, paid or spent $47. I was my $50 budget. This week I only spent $90 for everything. And that was really good, especially considering I had a $50 week last week. Now, one of my dear subscribers, Kevin, he mailed me a pop voice microphone. I don't know if it'll go with my computer or not. I'm holding on to it. I thought that was really nice. He thought it could be something that could help the channel. As you guys know, I have older equipment. I haven't really invested in it. I just, um, you know, just basic videoing without much editing at all. So I appreciate you guys being patient with that. Also, my dear friend went to Trader Joe's. She knows I love spiced mango. This is chili powder, I think some lime, and on top of mango. Love this stuff. I love sweet and spicy. She also knows I like th these green tea mints. She bought me a package of these. I love that. It's nice to kind of have that around. One of my other dear friends, we went to 99 cents only store. I didn't buy anything. I've never tried grits. She picked up one package of grits. This is cheddar cheese flavor. So she gave me a few of these out of her package because it was this huge family size package for 99 cents. So she gave me a few to try. Last but not least, my dear friend Teresa, she gave me this cow picture that her niece made. It's an arts and crafts. I have a place in my kitchen for it near my toaster. We're going to hang it up there today. So these are the wonderful items I did get. I wanted to share that with you. Also, just to let you know what the weekend brings. Tomorrow, I'll be doing a tour of my daughter's living space, who is a minimalist, and I wanted to show you what she lives like because I knew you'd find it very interesting. Sunday, I'm doing a really interesting video about the 10 frugal habits of the millionaire that got away, which is an old boyfriend that I used to date who is now a millionaire. I knew you would find that interesting as well. So these are the things I got, and that is all I have to say, I guess. This is Money Mom signing off, and as always, I love you. Bye-bye.